I just got word. Romania was a dead end. You're saying that he lied? Place is real enough. Deserted. But we found no trace that your man was ever there. Or anyone else, for that matter. Someone erased his steps. Hmm. We'll keep digging, of course. But frankly, it's as if the Earth just spat him out. Are you still determined? Does it matter? I was told there'd be no second chances. Don't believe everything you hear, Miss Burnwood. My decision stands. Very well. I'll be watching. The final test is based on an authentic 1979 mission. The high point of training Director Soda's career as an active agent. The target was Jasper Knight, a famous US chess master exposed as a Soviet spy. Soda's caught up with Knight at a military airfield in Cuba and eliminated him against all odds. This will be your objective as well. Now listen carefully. ICA exams aren't normally this difficult. Not only was the airfield a virtual fortress, but he even added additional guards. Sodas wants you to fail. He considers you a threat, and this way, your unfortunate exit from the program won't raise any eyebrows. Well, if he thinks we're bowing out, he is sorely mistaken. Good luck, Initiate. First things first, we need to gather some intel. Now, you didn't hear this from me, but I would eavesdrop on the two mechanics just beyond the fence. Protocol for the jet. Eh, it's on the clipboard. Look, you really have to do this, all things considered. We're putting a pasty faced egghead inside a Mach 3 fighter jet. Yeah, I kind of think we do. <sighs> I get it, I get it. Safety first and all that. I don't care which one of you does it, it's mandatory. Pick the box and get it done. So. Jasper Knight is leaving Cuba on a Soviet fighter jet, but first he needs to test the jet's safety features. Huh. Say you could somehow tamper with the ejector seat mechanism. You could presumably get Knight to trigger his own demise. Hmm. That might just work. Right. Let's get you inside. You'll need a fitting disguise. Hmm. A guard uniform sh should do nicely. But you'll need to draw him out and isolate him. Gee. Hi, it's me. It might be nothing, but heard something suspicious. Just a hunch, really. Good. He's distracted. Now's your chance. And they say cash is obsolete. So, this uniform should provide access to the hangar. Good job, Initiate. What the? Man, got some strange noises here. Looking into it, over.
check out a possible intruder. Stand by. Now he wants his girlfriend to go with him across the curtain. Naturally, Kremlin says no, wasn't part of the agreement. Knight says he's got documents on the other Soviet spies okay. in the U.S. Fueled and ready to take off. Good work. Are we clear to go over the safety protocol? Yeah, go ahead. I disabled the ejector seat mechanism. Good man. In order to make adjustments to the jet and perform the role of safety inspector, you're going to need a mechanic's disguise. Perfect. Now be gentle. He's an actor. Right, now to set the trap. The ejector seat mechanism has been disabled. You may need a tool to re-enable it. And now, to confront your target. Knight's office should be somewhere on the first floor. Well done, Initiate. I dare say this is an accident waiting to happen. Carry on.
Mr. Mechanic, what's up? Well, surely I must be overlooking something. Jesper Knight, we gotta go over the safety protocol. Follow me, please. Oh, must we really? Is it dangerous? Well, it must be, mustn't it? Why else would there be a safety protocol? I'm not crazy about airplanes. Is it going to do that thing where it flips on its head? I don't like that one bit. Not one bit. Don't worry. You're in good hands. Um, this way, please. So are we doing this or what? He does prattle on, doesn't he? Uh, you. Anyway, you're almost there, What's initiate. The All you need to do is read him the instructions in the manual by the jet, and Knight will take care of the rest. Boy, is he you, in sir. for a ride. Mr. Knight, we did some readjustments to the jet, and we'll need to do another safety check. <sighs> is this strictly necessary? Oh, very well. Okay. Hey, Mr. Knight. Climb in the cockpit, please. Uh, all right. Easy. One, one step at a time. Step one, strap yourself in. Uh, okay, all strapped in. Step two, locate the ejector seat handle. Uh, yes, you found it. Step three, pull the ejector seat handle. Right. Here it goes. Pull. Well, I never thought they would use a functioning jet. Good thing you didn't disable this parachute. Anyway, you did it. Excellent work, Initiate. I bet Sodas didn't see this coming. Now stay calm and head towards an exit. The group must have messed with it, that crazy bastard. Congratulations, Agent. You are cleared for field duty. I hope you know what you just did. The chopper leaves at dawn. Now get out of my sight. So what happens now? You go back into the world, disappear, stay on your own and on the move. When we need you, we will contact you. And so does. He played his hand, and he lost. He cannot touch us now. Still, I can't believe we beat him at his own game. If you know your enemy. <laughs> Quite right. I should tell you, the trail went dead after Romania. Our team found no records of any kind. No name. Nothing. 
I think they called me 47. That's not a name. So make it one. All right. Agent 47. Agent 47 and Diana Burnwood are the world's top assassins working for the ICA. Unknowingly, they have been hired by a shadow client to target a number of operatives of Providence, a secret organization working in the highest echelons of power. Providence's controller, the Constant, approaches Diana and makes her a deal. Eliminate the shadow client and learn about 47's past. But when 47 discovers that the Shadow Client is Lucas Gray, his lost childhood friend, he and Diana switch sides to fulfill an old pact. Destroy Providence. Together, they manage to capture the Constant, forcing him to reveal the identities of the three Providence partners. Eliminate them, and the war would be over. However, the Constant has an ace up his sleeve. 